So I'm a mixed media artist. I really appreciate mixed media because of its honesty. This idea that nothing and no one is ever just one thing and we all wear many hats and do many things. So I specifically work with photography and embroidery. I hand stitch directly into photographs. I usually work in black and white photography and then use bright colored threads. I love the contrast of realism you get within photography and then this whimsical aspect of the stitching. I've been in St. Louis for 10 years now because it's actually my 10th summer which is really exciting. I grew up in Arlington, Texas and I did not think I would stay in St. Louis this long but Washington University in St. Louis and there are programs my favorite out of about 15 schools that I visited. So I went to Wash U, I was accepted into the Emerging Artist Program with the St. Louis Art Fair and spent two years kind of apprenticing and learning everything that goes into being in an art fair and all that it takes. And then last year in 2015 I won the Emerging Artist Award and this is my first year being in art shows and art fairs on my own. Moonshadow Press is what I've called my studio. It represents this element of hope that I really want to come forth out of my work. Black and white photography is very intriguing to me because it slightly removes the viewer from the realism, just enough to create this space where you're willing to suspend your disbelief. So most of the time, the thread is representing some sort of normally invisible force in the world, whether it's creativity or imagination. Or like in my newest work, which is actually um, celebrating St. Louis, it's about connection and a certain timelessness. Normally, I only use photographs that I've taken. However, for this new series, I'm collaborating with the Missouri History Museum. They have a wonderful collection of historical photographs. So I partnered with them and we chose, or I chose photographs from the St. Louis World's Fair in 1904 and the Olympics that went on at the same time. And so I'm using my own photographs and the historical photographs to pinpoint and draw attention to certain similarities. But also to kind of get to see this very unique view into all these beautiful structures that were built for the fair. And the stitching within it, most of the shapes are kind of arch related, not only to point out our famous landmark of the arch, but to really focus on the concept of connection. And these threads are pointing out this like energy and connection and timelessness within the history of St. Louis and how it has had such a long, rich history that just keeps continuing to blossom and grow.